Don't look at me. I'm not decent. I'm naked. And it's terrible. I'm naked and afraid. <gasps> I Pelagornis was legit scared there for a second. Oh my god. You know what this means. I'm naked and running around in Ark? That's right, ladies and gentlemen. It's a new season. But you all knew that because uh, of the title and thumbnail and stuff, most likely. But welcome. This is the new Ragnarok Patreon server. It's gonna be a maze balls. So yeah, we we've got we still got the Ragnarok server with the zoo on it, but a lot of people we have got a lot of new patrons, and um, a lot of people are just looking for a fresh start. So you know what? I figured we'll go ahead and do this. Now, uh, I do have the Scorched Earth series, and I'm debating still continuing that, but let me know what you guys want. Um, I have a feeling with this new Ragnarok server that nobody's really going to be playing on Scorched Earth, and I really want to be doing a series where I'm going to be playing with the patrons. So, uh, I'm going to be doing this series. I might record a couple more Scorched Earth episodes. We'll see where the, um, the audience lies on that, I suppose. And uh, we'll just continue with one of them. I have a feeling it's going to be Ragnarok. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for this. It's definitely going to be a lot of people interested. And uh, Ark just crashed, and I hate everything. Well, now that we're back, maybe we can actually get somewhere. So, <laughs> oh, the good old-fashioned arc crashes nothing's better but yeah so this is just going to be a full-fledged uh survival series so obviously we'll do uh breeding survival uh trolling whatever our hearts desire in this particular series so i hope you all enjoy it i think this will be one of the other main series because uh, we've got the aberration uh, live streams the vanilla live streams and i was doing scorched earth but um as i said we'll, we'll see where that goes scorched earth is definitely one of my favorites but there is definitely a lot more to do on this so we'll we'll see where things go it's a christmas pelican <gasps> come back to me i want to put berries in your butt or meat you eat fish meat i want to put fish meat in your butt oh my god anyway so yeah, we need to find a good place to live. I decided to start somewhere other than the Highlands for once. I mean, it's like everybody always starts in the Highlands. And that's just too easy. So, I mean, it's also pretty easy, pretty easy over here as well. But you never know. Hello, Pelican. I do still need a horse. So that might pose a little bit of an issue. But I know they spawn around here somewhere. I think they spawn over yonder. But, um, yeah, there's not going to be any zoo on this particular season. At least I don't think so. And um, I know exactly where I am. Yeah. We're good. It's all good in the hood. But, um, yeah, I'm looking forward to actually recording with all the patrons. The server is not live, but the server is live the day this episode comes out, I believe, is when the server will be going live. So, uh, <laughs> figured I'd go ahead and uh, get a little ahead since they always fly past me, so I don't have nearly as much time to play as them. But, yeah, I'm super excited. Those of you that have been considering being patrons... Uh, if you want to, there's a new server for you guys. I know there's a lot of people that have been talking about uh, about being patrons and stuff like that, but worried about the, you know, being way behind. Well, now is your chance, ladies and gentlemen. Server is live today. Speaking of the server, these uh, all of my servers, including the Aberration servers, are hosted by G Portal, The best server providers you could possibly get. Guaranteed. You can talk to uh, Brad Wolf in my Discord about the servers of Sea Desire. And uh, my arc is uh, pooping itself again. It keeps getting blocked. My graphics card keeps getting blocked. And I don't know why. And it's driving me crazy. All right. I'm back. I just had to reinstall Windows. Uh, I don't know if I said this already, but I'm playing on Tiny Human's computer, making sure that it's good to go for this weekend. Because I'm going to try and stream with him. I don't know if he's got the attention span for it. But we're going to give it a shot, you know? I know he definitely wants to be able to play Ark on his own. Uh, he's going to be using a controller. And <laughs> we'll probably just play together. He'll probably just derp around with all the, the blue dinosaurs or something like that, which will be perfectly fine. Um, but I just reinstalled Windows, and I think we're good now. I'm pretty sure there was... Uh, <laughs> the graphics card kept blocking Ark Survival, like Ark, from accessing it. So it, I just kept crashing like every five minutes. It was ridiculous. But I think we're good now. And I can actually get some stuff done like a normal person playing Ark. It's pretty fantastic. 
And uh, I'm excited to get going with this. So, first things first, we always tame a Wilson. Now, we don't have a Wilson on the Ragnarok server. On either of the Ragnarok servers. It's really a crime against humanity when you think about it. Um, so we definitely need to make up for it and get a Wilson right now. Although, I would like to figure out where I want to live first. You can tell I haven't been to the middle of the map. I've been all around the map, but the middle. So... I do kind of like this area, and I'm thinking, mayhap, this will be around the area where I'm going to live. So, there is some islands. I'm thinking maybe, um, oh, I thought that was people, but it's just a Christmas pteranodon. Um, what was I saying? Yeah, I'm thinking there's a couple islands that I could live at, but that really is a nightmare. I don't know. Maybe. I might be adding the teleportation uh, gates mod. I can't remember what it's like, the Stargate mod. So that way uh, people can get around a little bit easier and not have to worry about going around bases and stuff like that. I guess we'll kind of see how it goes. I feel like... Oh yeah, I've got a stack mod on the server too. God, that makes the game so much better. It really, really does. If you don't have a stack mod on your server, get yourself a stack mod. There we go. But anyways, yeah, uh, we need to get some levels... Need to get some stuff crafted up. Some some basic necessities of arc, you know? Let's see here. I don't even know what arc season this is completely. It's like maybe like season seven total of arc. Seven seasons of arc. It's crazy. But it's fun, you know? Especially when you're playing with a good community like the Patreon community that I've got. And the gaming evolved community. It's just uh it just makes the game so much better when you've got good groups of people to play with. And uh really can't ask for any better community to be playing Ark with. Let's see here. Anyways, uh, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go ahead and get some levels here and figure out just a, maybe a little base just to park. I'm thinking, actually, was that the island I was thinking of going to? That might actually be it. I don't know if that was it. But there's also a good flat spot up here, which might be uh, decent as well. Oh, man. A level 280 female dodo. So if you guys... Didn't know, I probably didn't mention this. We're using difficulty 10 on this server. So it's not any mod that's doing this. We're just using a higher difficulty, which should make things a little bit more interesting slash deadly for those of you that are running around. I should do this whole season naked. Just make it my naked and afraid season. No clothes. Just 100% naked all the time. I'm doing it. I don't care. It's naked and afraid arc season one. We need some berries and we need to tame a dodo. And we're going to call it Wilsonette. I'm also very hungry. I need some food. I didn't craft anything. I just came up here. Uh, I believe max level... Oh, these aren't passive tames. What am I doing with my life? Um, I don't even know what I was doing now. I need to tame that thing, though. Let's see here. So, yeah, we're going to do this naked the whole season. And you guys are going to think I'm crazy. But, you know... Oh, I don't even... Not even level 8. <gasps> yeah, max level is 300 on here. So, this is a pretty decent level dodo. Come here! Go to sleep! We got our Wilsonette, and we need a, a male one. <laughs> so, long story short, you can't knock out a 280 dodo by hand. So we've crafted a club, and there's a 270 male dodo here, so the official Wilson of the series can we knock him out and keep him alive the whole series place your bets now ladies and gentlemen in a couple months we'll find out if wilson actually survives the whole series i have a feeling the patrons are going to try and kidnap wilson so that's a hundred percent a possibility it's been a thing for a while now but wilson will not be kidnapped and if he is i'll get him back all right, you need to go to sleep, little dude. Ooh, I'm gonna, I'm gonna knock myself out. Oh yeah, 69%. So you guys gotta use a club. On difficulty 10, you gotta use a club for the dodos. 92%. Come on, Wilson. You guys are probably sick of seeing me tame Wilson by now, but... I am not sick of taming Wilson by now. So, ha! There we go. Wilson! Wilson! <laughs> but yeah, so I think I'm actually gonna build... Oh man, I forgot how slow I walk with Wilson. Um, eh. Oh, Wilson, you're so fat. You didn't even let me throw you very far. Um, but I'm thinking... I don't know what... Sp 
Oh, that's a really nice Christmas pteranodon over there. Um, and this is an actually decently flat area that I'm at right now. Come on, Wilson, what you doing, Holmes? This way. And uh, I was thinking maybe, because the 99% complete update did come out. Ooh, what level are you? Level 190. Hmm. Not so bad. Uh, I do want to make sure I live near near metal, though, and I don't- I do not believe there's any metal here. Oh, I'm gonna die. Wilson, you're so slow. Um, I think there's metal up that way. Ugh, this might not be a good place to live without- Well, I don't really ever build with metal, so there's a lot of stone here, at least. There is a distinct lack of trees here as well, though. I don't know, I'll do a little bit of scouting and see if we can find a good place to live. You know, the nice thing about having a dodo when you start, and you're doing a naked and afraid season, you can cuddle him for warmth. It's really the best thing ever. There's nothing better to... <gasps> That's a raptor. <laughs> I was like, there's there's nothing better to cuddle than a good old uh, dodo. What's here? So there's this nice open beach area that I'm thinking of, of living, you know? There's still no metal here. There's one slight issue. Uh, besides the raptor, the wyvern trench is right over there. Wyvern, wyvern. You're gonna get butt hurt no matter which way I say it, so just just deal with it, okay? It's just uh, it's just how it is. People say things differently. It's fine. Relax. Everything will be okay. I am one with the bush. I am the bush. Or is the bush me? Okay, so that, that thing's running from something. So we got raptors all up in the joint. Might not be the best. I don't know. I kind of like this big open beach area, though, because I can make a lot of things here. Uh, I guess the scenery isn't amazing, but at least this could be a little start. I, I think I might explore a little bit. Maybe I'll be a bit of a nomad at the beginning of this instead of actually... Um, maybe what I'll do is I'll just go live naked with some patrons every every once in a while and steal their dinos. Oh. Yeah, this, this, is, this beach is just so nice. Um, but there's a, a lot of really cool places in the Badlands over there. I forget exactly what they're called over there. But, um, oh, there's like that up there too. I guess I really don't need, I just need trees and stone. Damn, pack out! No! No! I, no! I got a juke! Oh! <gasps> you little prick, you stole my stimberries. Oh, I'm gonna murder all the pegos forever! Revenge will be mine. I'm one with the bush. Ooh! Ooh. Look what we got here. A handy dandy Lystrosaurus. Everyone- That is a lot of dodos. <gasps> is it, it's a Christmas dodo. Oh, Wilson, you might be turning into a Christmas dodo. It might be a thing, good sir. Come here. Level 90? Oh, that's not a very good Christmas dodo now, is it? Eh, it's alright. We'll get our own mutations. Um, so I kind of- I saw this- this little area over here. I'm still just trying to scout on foot for a good place to live. Oh, I didn't know there was a waterfall back here. <gasps> oh, I might like this. I like this spot. I wonder what- can I live on top of the waterfall, maybe? That might be even better. I think there's a giga spawn on the other side, though, if I remember correctly. <laughs> Um, from traveling this way, is that where the Giga spawn is? I'm not 100% sure. Um, yeah, I'm pretty sure it's up on the other side. I'm like 99.9% .9 sure. So that's a little sketch. But uh, otherwise, I mean, we've got water here. We've got rock. We've got trees. Not a lot of trees. But some trees, which is better than nothing. Yeah, so I definitely think I like it over here. We do have some decent flat spots, and we've got a nice little pond, which I like. And then obviously the two waterfalls are a bonus. Um, so yeah, Wilson, what do you think, man? Do you think this is a good spot to live? Huh? Yeah? You like it, don't you? I can see it in your beady little eyes. So yeah, um... I guess all there really is to do now is make a home. This is actually pretty safe, too. I haven't seen any raptors up in this area. And uh, we got a Christmas trike over yonder. We've got stegos and stuff. So, yeah, this is a pretty pretty decent area to live. Can I smack you? Thank you. Wanna well, smack that wood? Well, needless to say, I may or may not have died. 
So, uh, we're starting over. <laughs> Been collecting a little bit of stuff. I did get attacked by an Ichthy, which I'm super duper butthurt about. But as always, I'm going to boost some good old-fashioned weight. And, uh, Water Vein. Place this to turn your windmill into a water source. What is this? Is this... This is... That is new. Interesting. So that's pretty cool. Anyway, so we've got a couple mods on here. We've got Castle Keeps and Forts, uh, Structures Plus, Pet Finder, Death Recovery mod. Basically just some, some normal things just to make your life and arc just a little bit better, you know? So... <laughs> uh, you can check out the full mod list and the rates in the description below. And um, otherwise, I hope you guys all enjoy the season. It should be good. Why is there no audio? There's no game audio. Well, so there's a small issue with this spot, and I guess it's really not a major issue. There's just, like, no berries or anything over here, so I have to, like, run all the way down that way to get any fiber or, um, basically any food. <gasps> Christmas salmon. Is there any... Oh, this is a nice, cool area, too. So I think what I'm actually going to do... I'm gonna build like my main house kind of in the middle here and make it like a log cabin and that way I can I can fish from there and everything and it sounds like a really good idea and I like it and it's not something I've ever really done before so I'm uh, I'm pretty excited for this season and I think I'm gonna build start building it right here this is the most peaceful start I've ever had to any server and it's quite astonishing that I have not I mean I died when the game crashed, so that doesn't count. I haven't died from gameplay yet, so that's a bonus. I have been playing Ark for a hot minute, so that also helps, I suppose. But there, our beautiful house. We don't have a door yet because we're not that cool. Uh, maybe if I just craft a whole bunch of these uh, foundations, it'll get me high enough level to get a door. We don't have really Ingram points. Now, the, the server isn't super duper boosted. It's the same rates that we use on the Gaming Evolve servers. And that way, all of you guys don't plow through the content in a day. Because I know you guys love to do that. And it's just not... <gasps> There's an otter. Oh my god, we could get a Christmas otter. Day one, living life up like a boss. Oh, don't go swimming when you're crafting. That's just the worst idea ever. Um, yes, we need an otter. And we need it pretty much like now. So, let's see here. We can kill a salmon, I think. I'd prefer just to kill it. What level is it? Watch it be like super duper high level and I just won't be able to get enough fish to tame it. Level 30. A female otter. I kind of don't want to build here now because it's an otter spawn. I've been having some good luck with otters lately. Let's see here. Can I kill a salmon? Ugh. You gonna come sweet? Oh, they're all... Yep, they're coming for that. They're coming for my butt, guys! Ugh. What you gonna do now that I'm out of the water, huh? Nothing. You guys are scared. Alright, okay. So we need to kill some fish. And the otter needs to get out of the water. Can we... I think... Yeah, we can drag fish while in the water, actually, now that I think about it. All right, let's just kill this coal. It's a lot easier than killing the darn salmon. There we go. Drag its lovely body. Come here. They're, so, they're actually easier to tame in the water, I think, than on land. Yeah! Oh, what are we going to call it? Oh, my God. I'm so excited. Come here. Yes! Oh, look at that otter butt. It was a little glitchy there for a second. All right, we need to get out of the water. Interesting. Like, uh, do we not lose stamina when... Sw oh, no, we're definitely losing stamina. It's just not lighting up. Okay. I was like, oh, that's a weird glitch with an otter on your shoulder. Um, oh, we're going to call her Lucy. Lucy the otter. Uh, options. <gasps> oh, I almost punched her. That could have been terrible. Tag. I don't need to do that on the server. Lucy. Oh, she's beautiful. Lucy, are you excited for the season of Ragnarok? It's actually my... Well, I started doing a series on the Gaming Evolve server. And I don't remember exactly what was going on, but I couldn't... Oh, that was when I was moving to Texas. Uh, so this is actually my first full-on Ragnarok series. I hope you guys are all excited. I do believe that is all I've got for today's episode. I hope you all enjoyed it. Let me know what you think in the comments below. I can't wait to open up the server to the patrons, which is today. Ladies and gentlemen, if you're looking to be a patron, 
join while you can and get your spots. And if you guys are already patrons, make sure to hop on the server and have some fun. And I'll see you all around. Bye-bye. Mm -hmm.